Howdy, fellas. How's it going? So, uh, I think... Welcome back. To, well, first of all, welcome back. Thank y'all for sticking around. But, uh, I think what I might do going forward, since the last video was a bit chunky, for lack of a better word, I get lengthy. I guess that's another good word. We got more size spam today. Um, I think... Honest... Do you need Roaring Moon? Uh, well, he's probably gonna lead... Indeedy... Probably Indeedy Hat, if I had to guess. So I think my better play here might actually just be leading Heatran. Hmm. I think I might just lead Heatran. Uh, I do actually want to hold on to Roaring Moon because Moon could be really good against uh, that uh, that Luna. I'm gonna lead Heatran, Thundee with Rillaboom and Arcanine in the back. I think Arcanine deals with a good chunk of this team pretty well. Yeah, let's do that. Do I need Arcanine? Um, I'm torn between Arcanine and Moon. I'll do Arcanine. Anyways, since the last video was kind of lengthy, I think I will play around with doing less battles per video, like one or two, try to make them more digestible. I'll probably just do two this time, uh, depending on how long this one goes. Skeletors and Guru. Okay, I could have let off a bit better. But we are fine. So I will... Um, I think I will just click Flash Cannon to Guru, and then I'll click Snarl. I'm not worried about what I might have to do. Because if anything, Skeletor is just going to probably click Torch Song, and Guru's going to click... Uh, Trick Room would be my guess. Yeah, so that puts Dirge back at a neutral state. Yep, I'm fine with this. Anyways, um, yeah, try to make videos a little more digestible going forward for now. Uh, to attract people to watching it a little bit better, I guess. Anyways, I'm honestly pretty fine with staying in like this. So I will just click Flash Cannon to Guru again, and then... Actually, I'm going to click Earth Power to Skeledurge and Wild Bolt. See if Skeledurge wants to... Ah, I see what he's going for. He's going for, uh... Just trying to snowball with Dirge. I could live a plus one. I could live another one. Because he's just going to click it again. Yeah, we're good. This is going to do a chunk to Skeletor. Oh, that's just going to one-shot it. Nice. And then a single target Wild Bolt will probably... I don't know if it'll... Oh yeah, that'll kill from 50. Easy. And then, depending on who he has in the back, we're... It's pretty much... We're good. Lurantis. Okay. Hi, Lurantis. Lurantis and Luna. Gotcha. That is good to know. Uh, I'm just gonna click Protect with you. And then... I could just go into Arcanine. Just get the Intimidate off. Because there's no way he's gonna click. Uh... 
Or I could just let Thundy die, honestly. Yeah, honestly. Just click Terra Blast into Lorantis. Probably gonna Terra Normal Ursa, yeah. Terra Ground Ursa, okay. So he's just, I mean, I already clicked Protect with, with Heatran, so. Loki kind of surprised that killed, considering uh, I'm EV and that's resisted. Whatever. One more turns of Trick Rumor left. I think there's one more turn. I think I'll just bring an Arcanine and then click Terra with it. Yeah, I can bring an Arcanine. Click. Oh, he's not? I just realized he's not Flame Orb. I didn't see that go off. Oh shoot, I didn't think about that. Oh well. Oh, there's two turns of Trick Room left. So I think I go into Rilla here. Yeah, I go into Rilla. Uh, and then I Terra. I think it's Flare Blitz into Lorantis. Because, yeah, since he's not Guts, uh, I should be able to take a, a, a minus one. Terra headlong with Arcanine, no problem. Fuck! Okay, that's bad. Cool. Next turn, I can just double protect to get rid of the Trick Room, and we will be Bueno. Well, this one's actually resisted, so yeah. And since this weekend, um, Grassy Glide will probably just knock. I don't even need to Grassy Glide, I could just Wood Hammer. And then we click Double Protect. Stall at this last turn of Trick Room. And then I just click Heat Wave. Hope that hits Lorantis, first of all. And then, uh,. Wood Hammer, the Ursa, and that should be game. There goes Trick Room. We click Wood Hammer into Ursa, and then Heat Wave, and pray that that lands. See ya, Ursa? I'm gonna take a lot of recoil. Because Ursa Luna has a ton of HP. Ooh. Okay, cool. Single target heat wave, that should be enough. Yep. Alright. There's that game. GG, James. So, default trainer card. Boring ah uh, player. Anyways, let's move on to the next game. Aquario X Grim. That's a name. He is using a team. We got Cornerstone Ogre Pond. That's a pick. Um, definitely lead Moon here. Uh, yeah, Moon's Moon just in general is a really good pick for this game. So I think doing that, and then yeah, I think Moon, Arcanine. I kind of do want to bring Bundle on the back. Do I? 
Yeah, I think having this counter speed control would be really good. Yeah, I'll bring Bundle in the back, and then... So he's probably going to lead Torn Flutter. So... He's going to lead Torn Flutter. I might just lead Moon Bundle with uh i think i bring really boom in the back i think really boom's gonna be really good might be pretty good into um into the cornerstone or ogre pawn rock i've never played against it though so i'm not too sure how it's going to do or how that thing plays exactly. If it's gonna play like like a Wellspring. Glamora Torn. Okay. Okay, I'm cool with this. The toxic debris is gonna be kind of annoying, but we run with it. So uh, I think we just click Tailwind and Icy Wind, honestly. Or just freeze. Yeah, I'm just gonna click icy wind or tailwind freeze. Okay, he's gonna. I'm fine with that. He's probably just gonna mortal spin, maybe. Power gem. Oof. Okay, well, I will just click Breaking Swipe, and then... Do we just Hydro Pump into Glamora, just to get rid of that thing? I don't want to miss. That thing's going to be a problem if it... Um... Yeah, I'm just gonna hydro. Mm. Fuck it, we ball. I'm still gonna be faster than it because Bundle is fast as frick, boy. That breaks whatever potential Sash Glamora has. Yeah. Let's go, baby! Okay, cool. Toxic Debris is just on hit, on contact. I wasn't sure if it was just on hit or not, because that's another mod I haven't really played into an awful lot. But we in there, boys. Kind of in danger. Okay, Cress. All right. Um... God, I really just want to click knockoff into Crest, but I feel like it's 100. Definitely going to want a Terra. So we will actually just click Protect on Moon, and then I'm just going to click Icy Wind. I feel like Torn is probably going to Protect too. Cresselia is going to Protect, okay. Sunny day. Oh, he's probably setting that up for uh, for Flutter. Okay. He's probably Heat Rock too. Um, I have one turn of Tailwind left. If he has two. Let's just click knock off into Cress and let's click Icy Wind again. Fuck it. 
I honestly should have just clicked freeze dry to crass. Now that I think about it. Keep that uh, flare main from getting a free switch in. Oh, well, Torn's dead. Uh, Cress is probably just going to click Icy Wind itself. Power Gem. I'm surprised he's going to target flood or my, uh, my bundle. Oh, well, that's fine. Seru Ledge. Okay. Uh, my Tailwind is gone. I clicked Knock Off last turn. I'm going to protect just... Yeah, I'm just going to double protect, stall out this last turn of Tailwind for them. What's Sarah going to tear into? Grass, maybe? He wouldn't do grass in front of Bundle. There's no way. But there is a way. Okay. I wonder if it's Clear Amulet. I'm kind of I'm kind of worried that he's gonna set up. Okay, he shadow sneaked. I'm fine with that. That's annoying. Okay, I'm fine with that. Um, let's click. Do I need to worry about Talon? Who do I have in the back? Arcanine Rilla. I kind of do want to get Tailwind back up. So we'll do that. And then... I guess we'll just click Freeze Dry to Seru. Yeah. It's a concern of mine is that he is Clear Amulet. Crest is probably just gonna Lunar Blessing again. Yeah. Ooh, actually, you know what? Let's hope that, uh... Okay, Sun is still up. Let's go into Arcanine. I guess we'll find out if this thing's Clear Amulet or not. Don't be Clear Amulet. Yes, baby! Let's fucking go! Actually, let's just knock off Sarah Ledge and then Flare Blitz into Crass. Yeah, honestly. Or do I want to just click Rock Slide? I'm going to Flare Blitz into Crass. Get rid of this thing. It's annoying. Alright, cool. I'm fine with that. Keep pressure on the Sarah Ledge. Uh, Roaring Moon is still way faster. This Flare Blitz is gonna probably knock out Crest. Yeah, Sun's up. I'm banded. I'm I'm pursuing Arcanine. There's no way that's living. Cool. And then I might just uh yeah, I kind of have to swap Arcanine out here. Just click knock off on you again, because I'm banded. And Rillaboom really isn't going to be doing much to... to um... Oh, he just quit. Cool. Well, GG's Aquario X Grim. You would have Sarah Ledge, the little edgy meister. Um, anyways, I'm going to end this video right here. So, two for two. Let's go. We made it into Great Ball. We made it to Great Ball at the end of the last battle, but mm -hmm. I'll just update it so we can see where I'm at. Almost a great eight. Is that how that works? That is how that works. Rank eight, Great Ball. Okay, anyways. Um, yeah, that's that. Uh, thank you all for sticking around and watching, and uh, I hope you all have a wonderful day.